Why, hello there, everyone, and welcome back to more Bloodstained and the Ritual of the Night. I had to do that one more time because this is potentially the last episode. And we just got the Zonget Supto, which will allow us to cut down Grimmery. So, the only lead I have right now is to go back into Jeeble's room, and that's where we're going, so. First, we have to make it back to a fast travel point, which actually is not that close. So, let's just run, make a run for it. So... The way Zongetsu was being familiar with Grimmery, it makes it sound as if Grimmery is actually from the East. Which may explain somewhat... That may somewhat explain why there's an area in this castle that looks Asian. You know, so if Grimmery's from the East, maybe she refashioned a little pocket dimension to look familiar to her, you know, like make it, make it look like home. Of course, these are just post-hoc explanations to justify having varied environments, which is completely fine for a video game. And aside from this carpenter boss fight here, and the other optional bosses whose keys I never found, there is no spot on the map that is glaringly obvious. Well, there's there's no spot on the map that glaringly needs to be explored. Places that I very obviously underexplored, you know? Uh, I don't see any doorways I haven't gone through. I don't see any big areas that need exploring. So let's just go straight there to Grimmery, who will be over here. The Hall of Termination. I don't remember if I've noted this before, but it's probably called the Hall of Termination since this is where you go to end the game. And termination means end, obviously. We might actually want to go stock up on potions. Let's make use of the fact that we've been hoarding everything. And... Uh, chug that pot in front of the final boss. And Grimmery was the, f was the final boss in Curse of the Moon. So it kind of makes sense that Grimmery and not Jeeble is the final boss in this game, but... I was originally thinking that when they were framing Jeeble as the final boss, they were purposely making someone other than Grimmery the final boss, since they already used that. We could turn in some of our slaying quest as well. I don't know if we've completed any since the last time. Have you learned anything new? Here's what I've turned up. Good work. Crimsonite. Got any target? Here's what I've turned up on the monsters. So those are the ones we've completed. These are the ones that we have active. So we have uh, none of them not accepted. None of them are left unaccepted. Uh, what did we do here again? Oh yeah, potions. So we can make potions or just just buy them. I haven't seen you in a while. I've been worried. Yeah, you don't say. So what'll it be? <laughs> this guy breaks the fourth wall. He was remember last time, some other time ago. He was telling us that it was late, and now he hasn't seen us in a while. He's worried about us. All webbing. We can only make one potion. Let's just keep our ingredients there. Tell me, what exactly is the Lee below Goyeth? A book written by an alchemist named John D. 
I remember talking about John D earlier in this playthrough. It must have been because this prompted me to talk about him. Oh yeah, yeah, we have. So we've seen this. We've seen this dialogue already. If you can summon good spirits, then all it takes is some changes to the structure of the right to summon something else. I suppose that makes sense. Miriam, you're back. You should visit more often. Yeah. What are you looking to buy? Okay, let's get a whole bunch of these. Fill me up. Is this right? Then we have Oh, they don't have any more. Ooh. Is this right? So there is a finite amount of deal. potions you can buy. Let's max these out as well. Is this right? Then we have a deal. Is this right? Plenty thanks. So we can't just chug these without any sort of constraint. What kind of sword is that? Thunder a thunderous club once wielded by a storm god. Yagrush. Yagrush. Anything else we'd want here? Discount card. Purchase items at a discount. Yeah, only after you cough up that much money. I don't know if you'd be saving more than 100k after you buy that. It seems like a ripoff to me. I guess that's for people that would want to farm everything and buy everything. Then it would be worth it. Oh yeah, let's get some ammo too. We can buy diamond bullets. Oh, man, that's expensive. What's the maximum we can buy? 15. We don't even have a... Well, that's... I don't even know if that's because of the... Oh yeah, we can't afford 15, so yeah, 15 is the cap. Hollow points are cheap. Let's see how much we can make first, though. Staying up late tonight. What are we trying to Maybe. This time? Ammo. Iron. Obsidian. We have a lot of. I doubt the final boss is going to weak is going to be weak to any specific element. Petrifying rounds. Bet bosses are immune to that. Scatter shot. Oh, is it saying for one steal we can get nine? I think that's the case. Whew, we can make a lot more than I thought then. I'll go with this. There, all done. I'll go with this. Diamond bullet, sir. Oh, silver bullets. The forces of evil. I bet that would be good against the final boss. We need holy water, though. Can we make holy water? Is that something within our power to do? Won't regular water work? Okay, we can make... Yeah, we can make it. Now let's make some of that. Make some of those silver bullets. There they are. Nine. I'll go with this. Cowboy hat. Is there anything else we can buy to buff ourselves? Not really significantly. Big spite. Oh, we could enhance shards. Yes. For example, she... Hi, Miri. Let's see what we can enhance. So what are things we use a lot? 
Oh, we should upgrade the healing again. But it uses potions. Nah, we'd actually get more potions. Honestly, in the long run, we'd get more we'd get more healing from the potions than whatever amount of healing we'd get from this because it's so weak. Have we maxed out uh Welcome Company yet? Where is Welcome Company? Oh, this is directional. Can not augment strength? Ectoplasm? I guess these are... These should require something more difficult to get than... Dagger expertise. I'll go with this. Let's upgrade him... Let's upgrade him once. Vert. Double jump. You can upgrade the double jump even more. Oh yeah, it's the iframes. Where is... The... Spear that I've been doing. No spear. Requires a spear. Can I make a regular spear? Spear. Bronze. Elm. Easy peaser. I don't know if it'll require a spear each time, so let's just make one. And... go back here. I'll go with this. Okay, another spear. Each time I add a spear, it increases the amount of spears I throw at once. So that's definitely worth it. Let's upgrade that as well because it's so good. So let's make another spear. I wonder if I can buy regular spears too. Because it, it might start requiring better spears. Spears that are better than the regular spear. Without any sort of special name. There, all done. Where is it? Another regular spear. This is going to be so strong. I'll go with this. Let's make two just because I think it's going to ask for another one again. So this is the I last like spear we can make, but after this we may be able to buy more. Ooh, I like it. I'll go with this. Crud, we made an extra spear for no reason. <laughs> I told you, the one time I tried to make more than one at a time. So it wanted a What did it say it wanted? Not a regular spear, but a, uh, was it a partisan? I should look, I should look again. Lance. Why are these not organized by weapon type? By category. Lance can't make it. Oh, I used the elm. Can I buy a lance? Stop back often. This is going to be so strong. I still only see three spears though. Maybe there are multiple spears in each one, or maybe maybe it's just stronger. Maybe I was reading something else. I have something new. What are you looking to buy? Plants. It's actually kind of expensive. Let's just upgrade it this one last time. Thank you. Come back. Because I'm acting as if I'm right by the final boss, but that may not even be the case. Staying up late tonight. What are we transmuting this time? I'll go with this. Increases coverage. I like it. 
So, does it increase? Oh, of the seventy-two demons. New, uh, new line. Grim. So Grimmery's one of the demons from the Ars Goetia as well. I knew Jeebel wasn't a monster. He's possessed by one. Wouldn't that be funny if Jeebel was actually controlling Grimmery? Then there's a good chance we can free him. Psych. I'll do whatever it takes. So will I. But Grimmery. Jeebel could never have accomplished something this heinous with his crystal alone. Or could he have? Grammary's power to his, well, uh, that pushes it into the realm of possibility. Uh, uh, I'm sorry. I, once I start theorizing, I, I can't be stopped. Ha <laughs> ha, what a nerd. <laughs> oh yeah, look at that. Four at once. Nice. This is so strong. It is costly though, of course, in terms of mana. Rightfully so. So it says we only have 79% of the map completed. That makes me a bit suspicious. It makes me feel like... There's actually going to be yet another area left in the game. Maybe an area right before the final boss. You know, like a place specifically... Specifically made to be the final area. Ugh. Input lag. Okay, so back over here. That's fine, Wing. Actually, that's something that was... I remember a lot of good things required that, so let's save. I know I'm penny-pinching here. It might not be that hard to farm, though, from these fairies. Was that from my familiar? That's a new attack it has. I haven't seen that before. Oh, I don't even need to go up here. I got another Vespine Wing, by the way. So I guess the drop rate's actually pretty good. Oh, gee, bull. I have a surprise for you. so long. Well, now that you've tasted the power of so many shards, I presume you're ready to join me. What took me so long? I'll have you know, a new Fire Emblem game came out, and those things can take up quite a bit of time. I still haven't beaten it, by the way. You presume wrongly. I'm here to keep my promise to you, and nothing else. What promise? Am I doing the right thing here? Is this how I proceed with the Zangetsuto? I swore to you that I would stop you if your Shardbinder power ever manifested itself against your will. You made the same oath to me. I changed my mind. You think I wield this power unwillingly? Blink once if you're being mind controlled. He blinked! I've known it since our meeting on the Galleon. There was a moment when I saw a flicker of the real Jeebel beneath all that hate. Fool! I've heard enough! If you want to stop me, you'll have to do it by force. As you wish. It's time to free you of this once and for all. Okay, this wasn't the dialogue from before, so I'm pretty sure I'm in the right place. So do I need to be using Zangetsuto against him or just Grimmery? That does so much. So this phase is purposely easy, I think, because you're able to do this part earlier. There we go. Forgive me, Jeebo. You... You... 
Wait. That was the bad ending again. Where's Grimmery? The right thing. <laughs> With that many shards bound to you, you will be all too easy to possess. What? Where is Grimmery? Okay, so that's not where we need to be. Um... So we were in here. That's a dead end. That's where we got the Zangetsuto. And I went back and... Uh... Zangetsu was gone. Where else can I go? Is Grimmery somewhere specific? Okay, where have I not been? Directly to the right, I'm pretty sure, is another optional boss place. Are you kidding me? I didn't save after going through that door into this place. I remember I went back and did it. I don't think there was anything too important important in there, though. Uh, maybe I can get a hint at Dominique again. Even though I, even though I just spoke to her. <clears throat> Hello. What can I do? Give me a hint. That's what you can do for me. Thank you. Come. Did you forget something? Thank you. I'll what does this NPC do again? Oh, I still have Nothing. Okay. Is there anything? Else? Yes, actually. But hang it all, I can't remember what it's called. Oh, what a shame. I just remembered I have to go do something. I'll help you figure it out. Okay, convex glasses, though. That looks cool. Round and topped with something gooey and stretchy. What? Round and topped with something gooey and stretchy. Cinnamon? A cinnamon roll with icing? Okay, so I literally don't know where to go, even though we have the... Maybe it's in the flavor text of the weapon. Uh, nope. I may have to do a... I, might, I may have to spice the video here while I think of where I could possibly be going. Maybe back on the boat, but probably not. Is there any place I passed by that looked like a final boss area? Any big shrine or anything like that? I could just look it up online. Where to go after getting Zongetsuto. I think I may actually do that just because, like I, like I said, I don't want to waste any time beating this game. And I don't think this part is even supposed to be perplexing. So, uh, for once, I actually am going to look up where to go in this game. So, sit tight while I do that, and I will be back in just a moment!
Okay, I am back. I just looked it up online. Apparently, I was right to assume that I should go rematch Jeebel, but instead of beating him, I'm supposed to just wait it out until the moon turns red. And I didn't really see anything... Okay, so, like, they used invert. <laughs> I was going to say I didn't see anything past that, but they used invert, so... After the moon turned red, they used invert, and then I stopped. It was a video. I stopped the video there, so I don't know what happens past that. So, let's go up and do that. Th this seems very unintuitive, by the way. I don't know if I would have ever... Well, eventually I would have realized this, but... Or, I mean, eventually I would have tried it, but this is very unintuitive. I really don't regret looking that up at all, because... I went there, you know, and beat Jeebel again. And I got the bad ending yet again. So, it was really dissuading me from just trying it yet another time. But we're supposed to wait it out, the moon turns red, and then they uh, inverted. So, let's see what happens. That is very cryptic, though. Oh, Jeebel. Jeebies. Invert isn't something I have to equip, right? What took you so long? Next time. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so I just have to survive. See, the thing is, if it was slowly turning red or something like that, then it would entice me to wait until it's fully red. But there is no sign of change on the moon otherwise. Let's try to save all of our mana and HP for the real fight. I jumped into that. I need to unequip my familiar so it doesn't kill him. It's too effective! No, it's still not red. I don't think it took this long in the video. Maybe I have to, like, actually hit him a little bit. Make it look like a real fight. Ooh, ouch. Ooh, so tough. Ooh, I'm going to get you, Jeebel. Ooh, I attack you. Ooh, I'm getting hit. Do we have to stage a fight for Grimmery? Maybe he has to be low health and then you wait. There it goes. So the inverted. I just smack it. What the heck? What's even happening? Oh, I do smack it. I thought I was hitting it. That's a cool effect, though. Smacking something in the background. Uh... What was that guy's name again? Arthur? Arthur? He's faking it! Don't trust him. I knew it. You kept your promise. He dies anyway. What's going on? 
No, the corruption shouldn't spread. This Come fast. on. It's it's better this way. The world can be rid of me. But this this castle, we can't allow it to. Shh, I know, I know. I'll destroy it. But you're going to live, Jibo. Glad I got to see you smile. One pass. I think he's okay. Jibo. Jibo. Don't worry, he's okay. He's just red. What's the point of getting the good ending if he dies anyway? Nothing changed except the old guy got his book. Which is actually worse than the bad ending because now he's going to run rampant with it. Are you ready, Johannes? I am if you are. Yes. I have a new promise to keep. If you plan to destroy the castle, you won't be able to do it without the Lieber Logaev. Then I need to track down Alfred. Gremory will be Alfred, not too. Arthur. <laughs> I had a feeling that was the wrong name. Tracking Gremory might be faster. The moon, you mean? I'll try it. So the moon actually is Gremory. Looks like he's here. Is he still here if I come back in? Rip, gone forever. So we're tracking the moon. Um. How are we going to do that? What's a place that's outside? Other than over here. Uh, maybe the place over... No, that's the Oriental Sorcery Lab. Maybe this place, you can see the moon better. Let's see if we can teleport there. This place doesn't really have a good teleport point, though. It's the fastest way there. If I go down... Nope, that won't work. Well, kind of. First, let's try... Let's look outside over by the hub. Just because it's a lot easier to get there. I don't even remember if it was here normally. Where would I even be looking? Maybe the tower? It's not going to be underground anywhere. No, but even up here, this part's indoors. I hate going back to this place, but I think this is actually the fastest way there. Crud. I thought I could... For some reason, I thought I could go over to this side. But I need to... Still don't know how to get up there. I guess it's part of the puzzle. But let's just go down. Get me out! Here we go. 
Um. Pretty sure there's a lot of area where you can see the moon over in this place. If memory serves. But I need to go out to these parts. So I need to drop down somehow. Is that even possible here? I don't think it is. Did I wind up going to the wrong place? Yeah, I think this top part sealed off. Is there any restart? Just kill me so I can respawn. I need to get back to a fast travel point and it's, it's easier and faster if they just kill me. Oh no! So... I guess this place is actually closest. We can go up. Does Dominique have a hint again? I doubt she'd say anything more specific than what Miriam already said, though. Hello. What? Thank you. Wow, useless yet again. I can't think of any other outdoor areas aside from the boat, but that would be stupid. Maybe, though. We'll try the boat next if this place isn't it. And then after that, if it still takes us too long to find it, I may just look it up online again because we've already tainted the playthrough. Our hands are already dirtied. Am I in the right place? Yeah. Okay, so I definitely see the moon. So I guess we just have to track it and slice it. Can't hit it. Can I not hit it as I'm falling up? Okay, this is most definitely the moon. Maybe this is the real moon and Grimmery is just a fake one. 
trying to hit it as I'm falling. I had to be pretty specific with where I hit it last time. Wait, is it moving? No. Thought it had moved to the right a bit. But it was just our perspective. So, falling into it does nothing. What else could we be doing with it right now? Trying to do the double jump after. Why is it not letting me? If I leave this place and come back in, will it still be there? Maybe I'm just looking for the red moon. Maybe I'll take a picture. <laughs> it might be useful for reference later, though. Okay, the clouds are covering it. Okay, clouds were not covering it this heavily last time. There. Maybe it's... Maybe I'm looking for the red one. Uh... So the same moon is here. So I'm wondering if this even has any significance at all. tried this area yet. Okay, we were inside of those blocks before it even fell, but apparently that's how you get in this way. And is the moon here as well? Can't see from over here, from underneath this. Yeah, it is. No noticeable change. I guess we could try the boat. That place is underground. What are the other places where you can see the sky? Not the entrance. Oh, maybe, uh, the area with... The... Uh, carriage with the horse carriage? Where am I right now again? Right here. I did not mean to do that. Do I really care about... Uh, about saving after that thing broke the bricks. Not really. Let's just restart. So I don't have to walk all the way to another fast travel point. It's not as if I hadn't been in that hallway before. That bell falling just opened up the way to get in from that side.
Okay, let's check the Garden of Silence and the boat. And after that, I'm out of ideas. Garden of Silence is over here. Takes us in like the middle of it though. I'd rather enter it from one side and then sweep through. So the moon is definitely here as well. And this moon isn't as big, so maybe this is the one we need to attack. Can't really get a good angle on it though. Hey, is that a magic file? It is. So maybe, I think we have to slash it with Zongetsu too. I was wondering if we could shoot it with an arrow or something though. So considering we found two differently sized moons, neither of which are Grimmery, I think we have to actually find a red one. Wherever that is. Or Horse's Key, so that's another optional boss door. That requires a key that we do not have. Is this the entrance to the Gardens of Silence? Well, there's no sky on that part. What about over here? Is he on both sides? I guess they loaded him on both sides because they're just assuming that until you get invert you were you would only be able to see him from one side the same side that you entered from anyway but that's kind of immersion breaking once you uh once you get invert and you can see two of him There's sky over here. I think this is where the piano is. Yes, it is. Another moon. Another giant moon that is not red. Hold on. What does the sky look like, particularly, where we fought g -Bull? Because maybe if the sky looks a certain way, it means that the moon will appear in other places with the sky that looks similar.
Are you kidding me? I didn't save after doing that. That means that the places I looked with the moon might actually be the place. What took you so okay, so I'm going to end this episode here. And I'm going to go ahead and fight Jeeble again off screen. And do that whole cutscene again off screen. And then the start of the next episode will begin after all this has been done it a second time. So I will see you there. Don't mind me. Just... Let me do this again.